bringing you the news and information you need from the people making a difference. This is Comcast Newsmakers. Well, I'm glad you could join us. Uh, Mark Kepler is back with us once again. He's director of the Maddy Institute. They're doing a lot of work to get people involved in the political process. And they're also having a gala coming up. And I like to use the word gala. It's so, it makes it so big, doesn't it? <laughs> it is That's big. It's not a party. Well, we hope it's, it's big. It's a gala and with balloons and things like that. <laughs> is that what it's about? Well, we're actually celebrating yeah. uh, three uh, legislators who are uh, leaving the, the state legislature who have all been known uh, for principled uh, leadership. Uh -huh. uh, Senator Dave Cogdell and Mike Valines were just recently awarded uh, the Profiles and Courage Award from the Kennedy Library. Uh, and uh, Juana Rambula, who is also from the area, uh, was recently noted by another politician in Sacramento as being the most ethical person in the legislature. So those three folks are uh, leaving the legislature, and we wanted to celebrate their work, and so that's what the gala is. It's on September 9th at 6.30 here in Fresno. and uh, where, where is it going to be, though? At the Fresno Convention Center. And uh, we're going to have uh, Willie Brown, the former uh, Speaker of the Assembly and San Francisco Mayor, is going to be one of the MCs. Congress He's a great guy. I know, I know Very, him. very yeah. interesting. Uh, and yeah. Congressman Jim Costa uh, is the other MC. And they're going to have, hopefully, some interesting stories to tell about uh, these folks and their time in the legislature. Yeah. If Willie Brown's on the stage, he's got a lot of interesting things to say. He does. He's, he's a, a great storyteller and a great very, guy. You know. Very interesting guy. Okay. Now, this is open to the public, I'm, mm -hmm. sure, I'm sure. Yes. Yes, know. it is. Um, it, it is a fundraiser uh, because yeah. one of the things that we do at the Maddie Institute is uh, create scholarships for students so they can spend time in Washington and Sacramento observing the political process. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, 250 a plate, um, mm -hmm. $400 for a couple, and uh, I believe it's $2,500 for a table of 10. Balloons? Yeah, balloons. They will get balloons, but it's going to be. I know that, Mark. It's, it's going to be. It's going to be. Uh, you know, a dinner with wine, uh, yeah. et cetera, and uh, a very interesting evening uh, with some interesting political folks. Okay, now you mentioned something I wanted to ask a little bit more about, and that is they raise money to help people go back to Washington D.C. Is that right? Correct. They go back and they spend a week or a month. No, they spend the summer. A summer, a summer clerking in in in, yeah. in a legislative office. What a great office. experience that is! Oh, you know, it's life altering. Um, yeah. A number of these uh, graduates of our program have gone on to law school and graduate school and getting really uh, get really excited about the political process. And hopefully, those folks are going to come back to California and help make our state a better place. Yeah. Well, so. where do you teach? Uh, teach, teach, teach. Um, you know, you're doing political things and teaching politics and so forth. Uh, what are you seeing in terms of people who are coming through, taking your classes, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, are, they, are they more informed than ever because of what's going on in television and media? You know, I don't know. I think a lot of students now these days are so busy uh, with school, with work, trying to pay for school, with maybe family obligations, that maybe they're not as connected really? uh, That's interesting. as they've been in the past. And, and we're trying to get them to kind of focus on that because if they don't pay attention, if they're not involved, uh, things could happen that could be very adverse for them and their families, and they need to understand that. Uh, once they get a taste of it and they kind of see that, gee, I actually can make a difference in making my community better, they get very excited about it. So. We want to instill that kind of excitement and enthusiasm. Job. I mean, you're right. a professor, you're, you're teaching them that. Right. Yeah, okay. So, again, getting back to the gala, it's mm -hmm. fun to say, <laughs> and I'm sure it's fun to be there. You know, um, it's open, as I said, to the public, and right. you can make reservations how? Uh, by calling our office at 559 278 1133 or logging on to our website at maddieinstitute.org. Uh, we've already had uh, some major sponsorships from uh, Foster Farms. Uh, from uh, the University of Cal State Fresno, um, but we're hoping other people step up to the plate because most of this money is going to be used toward scholarships, and uh, it's it's a tax write-off, and it's nice to see that money go directly back to the students because uh, all that money is going to be given to, to student scholarships. Yeah, okay. I mean, it's difficult enough for students these days to pay for college to go through it. I know I've had kids going through college. Oh, it's critical. I mean, if, if yeah. we don't provide that funding, they can't do it. And so they, they, they then don't have that opportunity. So we want to provide that opportunity because, as yeah. I said, it really is a life-altering event for a lot of these students. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Again, the date is September? September 9th uh, at 6.30 at the Fresno Convention Center. Okay. Nice to have you again, Mark. Mark Kepler has been our guest. He's director of the Maddie Institutes. September 9th. Don't forget that. The gala. Thanks very much for watching.